If you have an import from China, but you find it difficult to do cost calculation, whether you import from China using 68A, Pindodo, or Idofish, or any Chinese e-commerce platform, but you find it difficult to do cost calculation, consider to watch this video. We have a so let's end the tutorial and see how to do cost calculation. Me right here, I have an example I'm going to use so that you guys can get it very well. So I'm going to put this example in uh, the screenshot of this example. I'm going to put it on the screen of this video so you can follow. So when you import from China, whether you use 1688, Pindodo, or Idofish, just like what I say in the beginning of this video, this video is right for you. It's going to show you step by step on how to do cost calculation. So let's get started. But before we dive into the tutorial, as you know me, my name is Rafi Yakub. I'm an importer and a procurement coach. If you want me to procure a link on 1688, Tauba, or on Pindodo, or Idofish, or you want me to coach you step by step on how you can be a procurement agent, or you want me to pay your Chinese supplier, consider to contact me on WhatsApp with the number in the description of this video. So with that being said, let's start the tutorial and see how to do cost calculation when you import from China step-by-step -step tutorial. So let's begin. Just like what I explained in earlier, I'm going to put a, an example on the screen of this video. I have with me right here an item. So this item right here is 6.7 kg and the flight cost is 41.5 USD. Clearing, local clearing cost is 3,720 naira. So what I want you to take note right here is this particular item right here is just 6.7 we have weight 6.7 kg. All right, then we have fright. Fright to be 41.5 dollar. Then we have local clearing to be 3,720 naira. Alright, so this is what the shipping company is going to give you, most especially if you are a Nigerian. Now, how do we solve this and how do we calculate our total cost? Total cost of uh, clearing cost, okay? So for you to do that, so right here we have 6.7 kg, which is the total kg of the items, okay? And we are given this as a price of the freight price. That is international freight price from China to Nigeria. So the cost, the total cost here is 41.5 USD. Now, how do they arrive at this? That is what we need to con consider first. So for us to consider how do they arrive at this particular figure of 41.5 USD. All right, so we need to know how this company arrived at this 41.5 USD as their international price. So for us to know this amount, what you need to do is that the price must be given you must be given to you by your shipping company. Let's for instance, the shipping company I used to ship this item, the price per kg, price per kg is six point two dollar. Right now, if a price per kg is six point two dollar, and the total kg is six point seven kg, so for us to know the Price price, so we have to say 6.2 dollar multiplied by 6.7 kg is going to give us international freight. So if you multiply 6.7 by 6.2, so you have 41.54 dollar. All right, this clearing cost is a very simple formula. What you need to do is that this freight 3720 divided by the total kg, which is 6.7 It's going to be 3,720 divided by 6.7 So we are going to have 555 Naira per kg So that is how they come about this 3,720 Naira And we know how, how they come about this freight price and we know how they come about this local clearing cost. Now we need to know the total cost. So for us to know the total cost, the, the simple formula is that freight plus local cost is equal to total cost. Okay? That's how we're going to get it. Now for the freight price, 
Freight price, a shipping company is going to give you the rate at which they ship packaging. This particular company right here, the rate that I was given by this company was company rate is 800 and 865.5. That is the rate I was given by this shipping company. Now, for us to know the total cost in Naira, this is Naira now. So for us to know the total cost in Naira of international freight, what we need to do right here is that we have to multiply so open brackets for 41.5 dollar close brackets by 865.5 all right so by the time we, when we multiply 800 865.5 multiply by 41.5 so we have about equal to we have 35 Point nine one eight. So this is the amount in naira, five thousand nine hundred and eighteen naira. So let me write it the code here: thirty-five thousand, thirty-five thousand nine hundred and eighteen. So this is for international flight in naira, in naira. All right. So we need to know the total cost of everything in naira. So we are going to have flight plus clearing cost all right so we have our freight cost to be 35918 naira plus the local clearing cost here which is 3720 naira so we have to add it together so we have to have 35918 naira plus 3,720 Naira. So it's going to give us 39,638 Naira. This is the actual amount that we are going to use to, to clear this 6.7 kg items right here. So the amount we are paying in Naira is this. This is the only information that will be given to you by the shipping company. So it is now your responsibility to do your calculation, to know how they come about this particular freight price and how they come about this, which is what we do at the initial stage of this tutorial. We are able to arrive at this 39,638 Naira to clear this particular 6.7 kg shipping from china to nigeria so this is what i have for you as far as how to do your cost calculation when you ship from china whether you use 1688 pin or ivory fish or you use any chinese e-commerce platform this is just the simple formula you need to follow in order to calculate your cost of shipping i hope you really got value for this video if you find this video useful give this video a big like and also if you have not yet subscribed to the channel remember to click on that subscribe Turn on notification bell so each time I post content about importation from China or some other country importation business, you'll be notified. And lastly, but not the least, if you want me to procure a link on 1688 Taoba or on Pindudo or Idle Fish, or you want me to coach you step by step on how you can be a procurement agent, or you want me to pay your Chinese supplier, consider to contact me on WhatsApp with the number in the description of this video. Thank you so much for watching this video from the beginning to the end, and I hope to see you in my next video. Bye for now.